know what to sign for me So ask if you raise your glass, you pass the test Nine is still young, there ain't no stress Well, I drink to this and I drink to that Don't know why I drink and I don't mind Just grab yourself a glass, let's have a drink You raise your glass Let's have a little soul So raise your glass And let's have a little more Raise your glass Let's fill it to the top Let's see the bottoms of you Raise your glass Hello! Welcome to another episode of Beer Show ND Well, I might as well have the accent The Irish brum Welcome! No, 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 that's German <laughs> Jesus <laughs> Christ! <laughs> <laughs> is welcome! <laughs> Welcome to another episode of Beer Show and Bay. Tonight we're doing a beer from Picaroons. You're way off, my dude. What's this, what? Scottish? That sounds a lot like Scottish. Oh, I like the haggis. <laughs> Tonight we're doing an Irish red. That's still Scottish, my dude. <laughs> Tonight we're doing an Irish red. We're doing Irish red. <laughs> <laughs> From Picaroons, it's a Irish red. So the best so far Irish red I've tasted. We went Four Rivers and Artisan La Folle Red. La Folle Red Artisano. Mm. We even had posts mm. on Instagram that I had a, a, a whole growler and. So, wanna do the honors with me? I'll do the honors. Do the honors. Somebody's blending you make some food upstairs. Wow. Oh, there's an ASA. Compression to that one. Compression of tabarnak. King he did. Mmm. Ça sent bon, he did. Mmm. Tu peux traduire ça. Mmm. Ça sent bon. Oh. Mais là. Jab, jab, jab. Jab, jab, jab. jab. So it did not sound Irish. Kiss me, I'm Irish. Pour it. It's a four. It's a four. Or a four point five. Make it work it by saying. Let's do the thumbnail. Let's go try. And three, two, one. Hey. All right. <coughs> <coughs> Wheat barley. Blit et orge. Sounds at a 4.8. Sorry. We cut point a bit. Excuse me. Excuse me, sorry. Excuse me. Yes. Ooh. Nice color, though. Big blue. Mm. Ching ching. Ching ching. Damn it. Where's the ching ching? Ching ching. Ching ching. ching, ching. Chin chin go bliss. Car bliss? Car bliss. Mm. Ça sent alright, I'm an Irish red. Mm. I don't know if it's just me, but I kind of taste the can on that one. Yeah. Not a 10 out of 10 right away. Um, as a previous episode, and we always said, from cans to tap, different, different tastes. Different. Comme on a dit sur différents épisodes, la canne puis la fuite, c'est pas différent goût. This one really took the taste of the can. Kind of disappointed. The beer is good. It's all right. I didn't say it was bad. No, oh. it's not bad. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's I don't know what language that is. Ja. Ja rule. Yeah, even the smell. The smell of the can. Yeah. So I would say this one has been at the liquor establishment for a little bit. And it's still good. It's not yeah. cool, bon. But I'm already ready to score on this one. Yeah, this is what short I, I, I love Irish Reds. And... 
I'll give this one an 8. 7.58. I'm giving this one a 5. Because of the can taste? Because of the can taste. Yeah, 8. The reason why I'm giving it a 5 is because I want to go to Picker Rooms. I don't want them to prove it otherwise. Yeah. Well, that's probably something for later on. Another Frederick, Frederick in tour. Uh, You're giving it an 8, you said? Uh, I'll go with 7.5 just for the taste of the can. Because I'm sure it's a good one, man. I'm sure, I'm sure it is. I'm sure it's a good beer. Uh, pretty sure you're going to see this and it's going to say, oh man, sorry. Sorry for the cans. And then, uh, yes, we would like to say, try it out of the tap. I'll uh, I'll go to the tap room and just open up the tap. Because <laughs> I'm a big fan of Irish Reds. Oh, yes. Big fan of Irish Reds. Um, damn, it's a bummer. It's a bummer. 7.5. I, I, I feel bad for penalizing this for a bit. Cause of the, yeah, because of the taste of the can. I'll give it a 6.5. Yeah. I'll give it a 6. I'll, I'll go 1.5, but I really just want to give them the benefit of the doubt. Yeah. Because it's out of a can. So, yeah. Uh, and it's not their fault. It's, I'm no, not no, saying no, it's no, their no, fault. No, 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 no. It's not their fault. It's just it took really took Because you, be really you can get... You can get... Uh, bad cans too that's been shaken or whatever and as soon as you open it up carbonation just explodes yeah. or the taste is oh yeah yeah it like, happens it happens it's, it's, can always, can't always do that because I had some cans that I filmed and that happened uh, you open it up the can and it's just like it shits all, all over you um, it shits all over <laughs> you <laughs> exactly um, like, like on beer show and me we can have the bad the good experience in the middle everything but nothing beats the tap room experience that's why I we asked the big ass road trip 2.0 we're actually going places and tasting out of the tap and stuff like that and we might do surprise visits I will explain what you will do late later we might do uh, surprise visits. Maybe you already you guys already saw, or this episode you guys didn't see. But we will do surprise visits, and actually film beer show and me. Do like I said, artisan. Do a sample, this out of the tap. So yeah, seven point five. That's for me. Six point five. Yeah. So to the next time. We taste this one. We'll probably be tasting it out of the tap. Mm -hmm. Not I'm me. Excited not for that one. I'll, I'll I'll ask if I can just go out under the tap and go. <laughs> you know what? If they if they let you do that, that'll be fucking baller. Because I've been to Picky Ruins once, and I want to go back to have tea. Because it, it was a short visit. <clears throat> it was a, hey, I'm here. Drink. Hey, bye. Salut. Salut. But I want to go back. You want to have the you want to have the experience. Yeah, the tap, uh, the roundhouse, and everything. So yeah, seven point five, six point five. See you guys on the next episode. Bye bye. See you later.